morning guys, it's Deathmonk here. Today we're going to be taking on our next mission here in the Black Ops campaign. We've got the uh, numbers. Investigate the extent of Project Nova by interrogating one of Dragovich's former associates. So without further ado, let's get this off guys. We have the dossier that the defector gave you with Mac V. We've ID'd all of Dragovich's men. Kopchenko, Steiner, Clark. You know them. Masterminds of Project Nova. <sighs> Nova 6. It is not called it Nova 6. Dragovich. What do you know about Dr. Clark? We know that Clark was the chemical engineer who formulated Nova 6. Malignant narcissist. Degenerate prodigy. Your handler, Jason Hudson, was sent to Kowloon to interrogate Clark. Do you remember? Why keep asking? You already know everything! No, Mason, we don't know what the numbers mean. We don't know where they're broadcast from. <laughs> well, why don't you ask Hudson? Kowloon was his mission. He interrogated Clark. Yes, a point there. <clears throat> Here we go, guys. Don't you morons get it? If you think your government sponsored brutality intimidates me, you clearly don't know anything about Dragovich. I have nothing to gain by talking to you. Think about what you have to lose. We can do this all day. We got plenty of windows. Or you can give us what we want and we guarantee your safety. <laughs> I'm already a dead man. I've been hunted across every corner of the globe. If you found me, so will they. They know everything you know. They're probably on their way now. Why? Dragovich doesn't like you, sense. I've never even dealt with him directly. Only Steiner, the German. What was the nature of your business? I was hired. To help stabilize certain volatile compounds. What kind of compound? Nova 6. Biochemical weapon. You let them right to me! Get your head down! Gunfire right to the canister! Watch your escape route! There's a hatch in the ceiling! This way! You inhale the gas? Let's blast him down! Target down! Which way? Up the stairs! To the roof! Target down! Target down! Dang it. Did you inhale the gas? I don't think so. Let's blast him down! Tango down! prepared for a dead man. Just because I accept the inevitability of my fate does not mean I'm in any hurry to embrace it. Whatever you say, English. Okay. 
Okay, I'm in. Hanson, ice left! Going to a lot of trouble to shut you up. What are you not telling us? I told you about Nova Six. Where is their base? Nam, Laos, Cambodia? He's hooked up. Euro Mountains, Yamatal. That's where you'll find Steiner. In his final preparations for Project Nova. What else? Whispers, rumors, anything. Steiner talks with Dragovich about numbers. What kind of number? The kind that their plan relies on. Confused that uh, I just couldn't move or anything.
Jesus. Wow. Okay. This way. Oh, come on.
Nazi scientist working for Dragovich. His name's Steiner. We're going to Russia, Mount Yamantau. Nice. We know that Jason Hudson briefed you on the intel extracted from Dr. Clark and Calhoun. Hudson said that Clark was insane. Paranoid. Fixated with numbers. Clark created Nova 6. A nerve toxin that can rupture a body in seconds. Dragovich is second in command. Crab Chamber tested in Vietnam. On them? On us? On his own? <laughs> he doesn't care. My father was a musician in Stalingrad. During the German occupation, the sound of his violin filled the air with magnificent music. Korsakov, Stasov, many of the great nationalist composers. To my countrymen, it was a symbol of hope. To the Germans, it was a symbol of defiance. Even now, his music still haunts me. The Nazi slit his throat while he slept. Collaborating with any Nazi is a betrayal, a betrayal against all of Mother Russia. Dragovich, Krushenko were not troubled by such matters. They look only to advance their own interests and agendas. Here we go, guys. I think we're playing as Victor Vesnov here. Everything is loaded. They are waiting. Victor, it is time. Yes, Dimitri. Time to hunt down the last remnants of the fascist Reich. Nevsky, grab the gear. We are moving out. The yeah. men and I have fought through the most bitter of winters on the Eastern Front. We were no strangers to cold, but even now, the blood in my veins chills when I think back to the events of that day far, far from home. Ah! The hero of Berlin graces us with his presence. Have you not tired of battle rhythm? As long as Mother Russia has enemies, I will answer her call. Put aside your petty rivalry, Kravchenko. Captain Reznov will do as he is told. We are here for one German, and one German only, Dr. Friedrich Steiner. This man has offered his cooperation to our cause. He is not to be harmed. Disobey this order, and you will be shot. Dmitry Pichenko, guys, was the uh, first to be played as during the Call of Duty World at War campaign. What happened in Stalingrad, between you and Dragovich? When the German occupation began, he and his laptop, Trachenko, left my men and I hopelessly outnumbered. Promises of reinforcements were made. Made, but not kept. Dragovich and Trachenko are opportunists, manipulators. They are not to be trusted, Dmitry. Dmitry Petrenko was one of the bravest men I have ever known. This is the reference. He fought by my side from the siege of Stalingrad to the fall of Berlin. The wounds he sustained 
ensuring our victory should have earned him a hero's welcome to Russia. But Stalin had little need for heroes. The German must not be harmed! We need Steiner alive! Now move! Both of you! Let's go! It is good to fight for your side once more. Yes, man. One final victory. Search every corner of this camp. Only Steiner will be spared. Ura!
Schwein, Dimitri! Scheiße! Einer verwundet hier! Du machst mir gerne große Teile! We will be where all power is As far away from the battlefield as possible. After this mission, do you think we will go home? I hope so, Dimitri! I hope so! Do not point that weapon at me, Russian dog! You will take me to Dragovich. As I looked into the German's eyes, I saw the fascist like still blowing strong. At that moment, Every fiber of my being yearned to put an end to his wretched life. But I was a soldier then. I still believed in orders. Reznov, bring your men! What is here that is so important? General Dragovich wishes to make a name for himself. He believes this outpost houses something of great value to the motherland. Dragovich and Steiner are talking like old friends. I do not like this, Reznov. You must right. hurry! There are Germans who will soon as he destroyed and captured. You assured me there would be no problems. I cannot control the actions of the SS, General Dragovich. They are sworn to defend the Reich till their last breath. Noble, but futile. Dravchenko, finish up here. Reznov, you and your men will lead the way. Yes, sir! Petrenko! Nikolev! Nevsky! Bolo! We are moving out! Steiner, tell me more about your association with the Gift Tiger Stern Project. In 43, the Fuhrer realized the Allies could not be held back for much longer. We begin to look for more 
unconventional solutions. Throughout the war, my own research was focused on chemical weapons. It was meticulous and frustrating work. However, what we finally developed was a weapon more effective than we had ever dared to imagine. The weapon now housed within this vessel. Nova Six. Affected the Nervo 6 chemical may be, you still had to find a way to unleash it. Long range V2 rockets to be launched from this outpost. The targets were command and control centers. Washington, D.C. was our first target. Then Moscow. Hmm. Ambitious and commander. But we were too late. The British were upon us and their bombers crippled the ship. Locked in the ice, we tried to salvage what we could. But it was too late. Germany had surrendered, and a Russian flag flew over Berlin. The SS had orders to destroy the ship if we were attacked. Clearly, they failed. The explosives were never activated. This is it. Reznov, open the door. We had found what we were looking for. Moffat Six. The German weapon of mass disruption now belonged to Mother Russia. Or so it seemed. Our victory was to be short-lived. Dragovich wanted to see the effects of the poison firsthand. It was also an opportunity to remove a thorn in his side. I had long known of their distrust. What kind of men they were. It was a betrayal. I should have foreseen. The new two hundred. Is a hero. He deserves the hero's death. Instead of giving his life for the glory of the motherland, he died for nothing. Like an animal. As I watched my closest friend die, it became clear we were not the only ones seeking the German weapons. The Western Allies circled like vultures. Of course, Dragovich, Kroshenko, and Steiner scattered like rats, leaving me to contend with the British. British commandos assaulting our positions! We will plunge this vessel into the depths of hell. We cannot let either side possess this terrible weapon. Oh, yes. Keep! No! 
Roger! He's right! I see him! There they are! Hey. Hey. We have only two minutes left! to think that the threat was over. It was only after I was captured and sent to Vokuda that I learned of Dragovich's true intentions. He would die before he gives up on Nova 6. Wow. Listen. Listen to me. We are running out of time, my friend. Can you trust your leaders to destroy it? Or do you think they will use it? The flag may be different, but the methods are the same. They will use you as they used me. You must decide. Decide what you think is worth fighting for. Dragovich, Kravchenko, Stein. These men must die. Okay guys, so hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did smash the thumbs up button. If you didn't channel, please smash the subscribe button. Don't forget to like and see more videos and I'll see you in the next one.